Um, Rich has a question for Richard Newman. And in Transformers Energon, does everyone remember that show? Transformers Energon. I, I, can't, I can't blame them. And in one episode, I heard Megatron sound like Rhinox, and was that you as Megatron for one episode? That's my understanding. Yeah. <laughs> Again, it's like some of this, especially with Cybertron, because that was, uh, or Energy, well, Cybertron actually, it was, yeah. uh, it was a, an ADR series. So uh, with the ADR, you might know, um, in, in a prelay situation, we're all standing around microphones like the old radio days, and we're playing off each other. Uh, and we do one episode at a time, and we can take anywhere from two to four hours to do that episode. When we're doing ADR, we're, we're uh, dubbing uh, a voice that's already been put in. And quite often, you're in the studio by yourself, you're there for two hours, and you do ten episodes. And you do your lines, and you don't really see much of whatever everybody else is doing. So those things can kind of slip by. Uh, and quite honestly, no, I, I, I did do it Megatron in one episode because David wasn't available. But uh, uh, the other thing about that series, which I find amazing and amusing, um, I started out doing uh, Vector Prime with an, a British accent. <laughs> And then there was a long stretch where we didn't do anything and they called me back in and it was time to do some more Vector Prime and they didn't have a voice ref for me. Oh, so we, nice. didn't, we didn't remember what I'd done before. <laughs> <laughs> so I just took a wild stab <laughs> without the accent. <laughs> and that's where it is now for all time. What happened to Vector Prime's accent? Well, he must have gone to theater school in America. <laughs> Obviously. Obviously. <laughs> All right, thank you. <laughs>